Hello and welcome to this brief tutorial explaining the use of uh, Virtuoso to create layouts of simple gates in IC616. Before we get to the layout design, a simple overview of transistor basics would help ensure that we are all on the same page. Seen here is a cross-sectional view of the uh, two transistors NMOS and PMOS. The NMOS transistor is built on the built straight away on the P substrate, whereas the PMOS transistor rests rests in its own envelope. Uh, so highly doped N plus regions form the source and uh, drain contacts for the NMOS transistor. Of course, uh, the body contact is formed using a heavily doped uh, P plus region. Likewise, for a PMOS transistor, heavily doped P plus regions form the source and drain regions for uh, the PMOS, and a heavily doped N plus region is used to form the body or substrate contract for the PMOS transistor. Notice again that PMOS transistor is built in its own N well. Shown below is the schematic uh, level view of uh, both these transistors. It has uh, the four terminals, drain source, uh, gate and uh, substrate or base connection. Likewise for the PMOS transistor. On the right side here we see the top level of uh, these transistors as seen in the layout editor. So PMOS transistor is built in inside its own envelope whereas NMOS transistor is built straight away on the P substrate. The square's uh, thin shaped uh, thin region being shown now is the gate of the device formed generally using polysilicon. So the length is along uh, the horizontal axis as being shown right now and the width is along the vertical axis as is, as is being shown right now. Then the diffusion regions form the source and drain contacts for the NMOS devices. Likewise for the PMOS device, this is the gate of the PMOS device again formed using polysilicon. The length is along uh, the horizontal line uh, as shown here and the width of the device is uh, vertical yeah, along the vertical axis as being shown here. Uh, the active region is formed uh, you, of active regions of source and drain is formed uh, using diffusion as uh, shown here. Let's go to the next slide. This is a circuit level uh, uh, view that circuit designers. This is a view that circuit designers are used to seeing uh, of an inverter. The symbolic view. Uh, then the circuit level schematic formed using a single PMOS device and an NMOS device. The gates of the two transistors are shorted to form the input terminal uh, shown as A here. The source of the PMOS transistor is connected to the supply shown as VDD here, and the source of NMOS transistor is connected to the ground. Uh, the drains of two devices is shorted to form the output uh, shown as Y here. Lastly shown on the uh, or uh, shown uh, rightmost here is the layout uh, view of the inverter. Again the PMOS transistor is sitting in its own uh, N well sh uh, shown by the lightly shaded grey area. Uh, the PMOS device this is the PMOS device and below is the NMOS device. The gates of both these transistors shown here in the black hash region is shorted to form the input terminal A. The drains of the two devices is shorted using metal one uh, shown using this hashed light blue color uh, denoted by Y. Of course the source of the PMOS transistor and the source of the NMOS transistor is connected to the supply rails VDD and ground. The PMOS uh, substrate contact has to be made so you need to connect the body terminal of the PMOS transistor to supply voltage. This is done using a well tap uh, shown here. Likewise the body terminal of NMOS transistor is connected to ground using uh, substrate contacts shown here. We will see a more detailed view of this. This is the view of inverter. A slightly more complicated gates are shown here. So the, uh, invert you can uh, lay out for a NAND2 gate, 2 input NAND gate or 2 input NOR gate, 3 input NAND gate and so on can be constructed similarly. Uh, this is uh, a representative uh, layout of standard cells. Uh, standard cells are typically designed by a company and available as uh, a module that can you can import into your uh, uh, design uh, framework. You see that these, uh, th as the name suggests, these have uh, some uh, standard uh, structure to them. They all tend to have the same height, which uh, makes connecting. Uh, or placing these blocks next to placing these individual gates next to each other simple the inputs and outputs are aligned across uh, are um, aligned to a fixed grid which makes the role of automatic place and route tool uh, easy so that uh, which makes routing wires for the place and route tool easy 
our aim of course in this assignment is to create the layout of a simple full adder so here's the schematic of a full adder formed using two XOR gates and uh, three NAND gates the standard cell library that we have uh, uses a uh, standard height of uh, I mean the height of cells in the standard cell library is around 1.6 micrometer it would be good if you can also make uh, layout uh, layouts of individual gates in the complete layout of full adder with this uh, uh, to this specification but if you can't do that uh, it would be interesting to see how close you can get of course for uh, to ensure that latch up never happens we have to put as many uh, well contacts or substrate contacts as we can so for your full ladder uh, it's expected that you put at least two uh, pmos contacts and uh, two nmos two well contacts for pmos and uh, two well contacts for nmos